In this lesson we're going to look at half and a quarter as a fraction because they're very closely linked and if you can master these it'll make your fractions much easier. But before I go ahead what I want to do is just look at what we've already done. So here we have a fraction. The top part is called a numerator, the bottom part is called a denominator. Now this is a proper fraction because the numerator is smaller than the denominator. Now this fraction here, it's an improper fraction because the numerator is bigger than the denominator. And finally, we've done this before, two and a quarter, you have a whole part and a fraction part. And if you have this, this is called a mixed number. So remember, proper fraction, improper fraction, mixed number. Let's move on. I'm going to use the pizza model. So there's my pizza and there's the center. Now I'm going to do a half. Now when I look at this, I look at the denominator. That's the bottom number. That tells me how many pieces I'm going to cut this pizza into. It's only two so all I need to do is carefully start from the top all the way down through the middle and continue on. Now I've cut this pizza into two equal pieces and I look at the top number and it tells me how many pieces I'm going to eat or I'm going to shade in. So I just need to shade in one piece. So now I have shaded in one half of this pizza. So let me draw another pizza. There's the center. And this time I'm going to do one quarter or one fourth. So I look at the bottom number, the denominator, and that tells me how many pieces I'm going to cut it into. So I need to cut it into four equal pieces. So let me start from the top straight down. So I've cut it into half. So I've got one, two pieces. All I need to do is cut each piece into two equal pieces. And the best way to do it is start at nine o'clock and go across. We're going to halve it again. So it's all through the middle. So I've got one, two, three, four pieces. And I want to shade in or I want to eat one piece. And that's the top number, the numerator. So I simply shade this. So I've now shaded one quarter of this pizza. So let me go through that again. Here's my pizza. There's the center. I want to do a half. Now, if I want to turn that into quarters, I simply halve it again. There you go. So now I have four pieces. I have quarters. So if I want to work out half, I divide it into two. And if I want to work out quarters, I divide it into four. Now, if I want to shade in three quarters, I've cut the pizza into four pieces. So I can shade in one, two, and three. So I've shaded in three quarters of this pizza. Now you try doing two quarters. There's the pizza and there's the center. So I need to cut it into four equal pieces. I halve it and I halve it again across there. I've now got four equal pieces and I need to shade two or eat two. So if I did that, one, two. And if you look carefully, I've shaded half the pizza or I've eaten half the pizza. So I can say two 
quarters is the same as or equal to one half. So I want you to pay attention to that. Those are called equivalent fractions and we'll come back to those. The key word so far I want you to learn for fractions is number one, numerator. Number two, denominator. Number three, proper fraction. Number four, improper fraction. So we just add the letters in proper number five mixed number number six equivalent fraction all that means is two fractions are the same in value So I'd like you carefully to write these down and then I want you to try to learn them and the meanings.